So in yesterday's hotfix, they buffed the Kazdolf 762, and what they did is increase its close damage range. So this weapon is going to be even better now in those closer range gunfights. So I'm going to be showing you a build and also showcasing the new goalie camo. So if you guys are new, enjoy today's video, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel with noties on, and let's get into it. Now getting into my first attachment, we're going to the muzzle and adding on the second tread 40. Now I don't know what it is with the Kazdolf 762 or the AK-47, whatever you may call it here, but this weapon likes to jump. So we're going to add this attachment on. It's going to calm the weapon down make it easy to control and this is why i'm gonna be adding it on for my first attachment here now the tunes on this what we're going to work on is some recoil control so we're going to move it over just a little bit here at point 23 and then for the recoil stabilization on that left bar what we're going to do is we're going to bring it up until we get to that three tick recoil which is that point 36 making this weapon really easy to control it's going to be very calm and you'll see that in today's gameplay on how easy this weapon is to control so make sure to copy these down here now, for the laser, we're going to add on the OV laser. Now, this can help with aim down sight speed, aiming stability, and sprint to fire speed, which the main two things I'm worried about is the aim down sight speed and sprint to fire speed. With this weapon getting a damage buff, I want to work on some handling so I can be more aggressive, and just being more aggressive is going to help me get higher kill games and everything, increase my level, increase my KD, and just have more fun on the game. So we are going to be adding this on to help us be a little bit more aggressive and have that run and gun type of play style here. Now, the tunes on this, what we're going to work on is aim down sight speed so we're going to move it over a little bit until we get to that three tick which is at 12.75 and then for the left bar we're going to work on some sprint to fire speed so what we're going to do is bring this down just a little bit at point 14 so we're getting the most handling that we can we're aiming down sights lightning quick we're shooting faster off a sprint helping us be more aggressive so we are going to be adding this on and copying this down for our tunes for attach number two now for the stock, we're going to work on the Kazdov Rama stock. So this is going to help with mobility. So we're going to be moving faster while aim down sights, strafing, and just moving in general and also sprint speed. So we're moving faster around the map, getting into more engagements, getting more kills. So this will help you just moving a little bit faster, which in Call of Duty you want to sprint and especially with having the unlimited tax sprint method. So you can either jump or you can melee. So you're constantly getting your tax sprint and just constantly running. So you are going to be everywhere around the map. The tunes on this, we're going to work on some aim walking movement speed, of course. So we're going to put this at 1.62 and we're going to work on some handling. So what we're going to do is bring this down as well and put it at 1.75. The rear grip, we're going to add on the Demo X2 grip for more recoil control, just making this weapon really easy to control. So we're going to add this attachment on. Now the tunes on this, we're going to work on sprint the fire speed, so we're going to bring this up at point .24, and then for the left bar, you have two choices, honestly. You have recoil steadiness, and you have aim down sight speed. Now since this attachment helps with recoil control, what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring this down for some aim down sight speed, so we're getting more handling at point .53, so we're aiming down sights a little bit faster, shooting faster off a sprint, but also keeping the recoil control that we have, so it's going to make the weapon even better to use. And then for our final attachment, guys, we're going to the ammunition type, and adding on the over over pressure rounds just to make us a little bit more annoying to go against and what we're going to do here for the tunes is we're going to increase that bull velocity so we're going to bring it over a little bit at 6.14 and then for our final attachment here guys we're going to work on some damage range so we're going to go up a little bit here at 0.38 but if you guys are trying to get your first mgb nuke 100 kill game or just try to get more consistent kills and increase that kd i do recommend this class setup it's really nice after it's buffed so give it a try and let me know in the comment section what is your highest kill game or did you drop any nukes but if you guys want to know the rest of my loadout before we get in today's gameplay we are using the hand cannon ballistic build if you guys want to try it out and copy it down here we are using the stun nade the simtex my go-to perk package which is scavenger double time fast hands and bird's eye and we are running dead silence so we can stay stealthy and quiet around the map but like i said this build is really nice especially after it's buffed so give the build a try thank you guys for watching you guys stay safe and i hope you enjoy today's gameplay that's one kill i really don't want to play kill confirm but i mean me searching for domination or hard point has been literally an impossible challenge so we are stuck with kill confirm and uh it does end at 130 so we do have to remember that that's all we do and i am shocked this hurts this hurts a lot this still hurts all right we're good but as you guys see here we are using the new Halloween uh, events camo, which is called uh, Goalie, I think. Goalie, Goalie, whatever it is. I, I just know it starts with a G. That's all I really know. But it is a thousand uh, souls, which you've had a good week to grind out the souls, which I do think this camo is pretty sick. And I'm um, hopefully it gets even better in Modern Warfare 3. 
All right, these guys are just kind of looking in the sky right now, destroying all my streaks, so that's good. All right. I don't think we'll get a flawless game here in shipment, but, I mean, it's worth a try, right? I mean, we got people using shotguns, so it might be a little impossible, but we'll, we'll try our best. Or if we can get, like, a lot of nukes, that'd be nice as well. So, we'll, we'll continue. Okay, that's not good. I'm not gonna lie, I am kind of freaking out here. Not gonna lie. I, I want to see Brutal. There we go. That makes me feel a little better. Perfect. Alright, teammate just got smoked. And as long as we don't run into people using the Doom shotgun, you know, we might be in a good position. Alright, there is our first MGB. And I still die somehow. I don't know how I did that, but we, we, we on it. Alright, let me see. My shotgun's better. Yep. We chilling. You're not you're not killing me today, bud. See you later. Alligator. All right, give me let me get another helicopter, please. There we go. All right, we're at 31 points. Well, 31 tags, I should say. Just keep spawn trapping. All right, we got another advanced UAV and a helicopter. That's good. Perfect. I'm gonna run. You're not killing me with that pistol, buddy. I'm actually kind of scared right now. I'm kind of like pinned down right now. There we go. There we go. Just as long as I don't freak out and just keep my momentum that I have right now, we should uh, get a good amount of kills and maybe a double nuke here, honestly. And I'm out of ammo. Not good. All right, we should be fine, though. Hold on, let me reload this. I'm going to... There we go. Perfect. Easy little kill. We'll take it. Hold on. There we go. This is actually kind of... I'm dead. I'm dead. Yep. I'm 100% dead. Yeah, I'm dead. That is... That is so pathetic on how people play. It's actually crazy. There we go. Throw this down. Easy. Easy. You know, I have to say... The skins that they have been coming out with here lately are so crazy cool. Like, this Groot skin here in Season 6 it was. I mean, this was a cool skin. Skeletor. Uh, the, the lady from Diablo. Which, I don't play it, so I don't know the name of it. But, really clean. And I think there's... I think there's another Diablo skin coming out on the 28th, I believe, which is uh, on Saturday, so. I mean, there's just so many cool camos and, well, skins coming out, really. Not really camos, which I don't think we'll get anything else, which I thought we were going to get an LMG today as well because a lot of people have been talking about the Bruin and the the FAMAS, the three-round burst uh, FR Advancer, really. Right, there we go. There we go. We got another helicopter. That's good. Thank you. Hip fire. Got a little nice spawn trap going. We'll take it. Let's see. Okay. Well, we just got destroyed by a shotgun. I'm going to chuck that down real quick. That should be a free kill. Or no kills. Unfortunate. There we go. Easy. All right, how many kills are there? 88. Perfect. I'm going to jump through here real quick so I don't get killed by a crossbow. I am probably dead here. I don't know. There we go. I'm going to call that UAV in since we do have a helicopter up. Can I have an advanced UAV, please? Pretty please. Because I am quite scared. I mean, we're, we're kind of on cruise control right now. Honestly. There, oh, and I got stuck by a nade. That is so unfortunate. So down bad. Throw that down. I'm, I'm kind of just pushing anything and everything right now. Oh, my God. Dude, this gun is so good. It doesn't matter if this weapon's been nerfed. It's still an easy meta. All right, let's keep pushing. We're at 111 kills right now. 
Let's keep pushing. Throw that down. We're going to reload. I might be able to get a double nuke here. We just got to play it safe. I don't want to mention me dropping a double nuke or anything because I, I do jinx a lot. I don't know why. It's just me. But, um, and uh, you see what I mean? Like, I, I'm terrible at it. There we go. I just know one thing that I'm good at is guarantee how many kills I'm going to get. That's all I'm good at doing is just guaranteeing how many kills I'm getting. Because we're at a 127. I mean, we could probably push 130. Uh, well, 150 maybe. I mean, we still have a good amount of time here. 132, yeah. We, we got this. There we go. Perfect. Just got to remember that the score ends at 130. That's what, that's, uh, I don't know why they nerfed it down to 130 instead of keeping at 150, but what do I know? Okay, I'm going to just push that dude. He has that, uh, that weird looking, uh, pot camo bundle. All right, 141. I mean, we're, we're getting real close. Can I call this helicopter in? Yeah, I can. There we go, 144, 118, we just got to be careful, that's all. We, we got to quit playing like that there, bud. I, I mean, you, you are going to get your kills, just quit camping. All right, nine points away, we did hit 150 points, which is good. And I think I'm going to go ahead and be safe since it is shipment, and I think we're going to go ahead and call this nuke in. Which, you know, eight seconds on uh, this map is uh, a lot of time, so. Just gonna have to. That is embarrassing shots I just tried kidding. That was really embarrassing. But I have to say, we did go crazy. We almost dropped 160 kills. I did wish I dropped a double nuke, but I mean, this weapon after its buff is insane. This new camo we got is insane. I do hope you enjoyed today's gameplay, alright?